let's talk about fossil water. Fossil water is basically a large reservoir of water that gets trapped in a certain area for a long period of time, usually millennia. The most common form of fossil water is in underground aquifers, where a certain amount of water from things like snowmelt or precipitation or glacial melt gets kind of trapped in an area, and then over time sediments fall and form over top of that, effectively sealing the water into an underground chamber. And usually it stays there for a decently long period of time, pretty much undisturbed. Another type of fossil water is found in subglacial lakes where a large amount of liquid water is trapped under a glacier. Kind of by the same mechanism, liquid water gets trapped under an area and the glacier just either forms or moves over top of it, sealing the water off from the wider outside world. Now, aquifers don't always contain fossil water and neither do underground lakes. Fossil water is kind of defined as being pretty much undisturbed. Many aquifers can have water flowing in and out and just kind of general movement, keeping the water in a kind of fresh cycle. However, fossil water is pretty much classified as having been there undisturbed the same water for a very long time with no exposure to outside water or other factors. There's no new water coming in and there really is very little old water leaving. The water effectively remains in kind of a stasis of being undisturbed. Aquifers are a very, very important source of water, and thus so is that fossil water. They're a very good resource, especially in areas in drought conditions where fresh water is not easily accessible. So a lot of people rely on these aquifers and fossil water reservoirs for things like drinking water and water for crops and all of that. However, the demand for fresh and clean water, or at least water that can be processed to make clean, is a very high demand, so these aquifers and fossil water reservoirs are becoming depleted at a very quick rate. And at least with the fossil water reservoirs, most of the time they do not get replenished. That's kind of the definition. There is no new water coming in, so when these fossil water reservoirs are depleted, they will likely just be gone.